There's a pleasant surprise. Yeah, so, uh, how is it in here? Oh, the bed is as soft as a fluffy white cloud, and the food is magnificent. Why, this jailhouse is far more comfortable than any fancy hotel in San Denis. How do you think it is, you idiot? It ain't tarnished your charm, at least. Your time here is at an end. Now get lost. Will do. Just a misunderstanding. That's right. You better stay in line. Hey there. <laughs> you goddamn idiot. They'll give anyone a pass these days, won't they? All right, I want to see you making tracks. Let's go. I'll back you up on this for sure. Why don't you go hassle some real criminals? All right, enough. You will stand down and come with me. You best oh, let me go. Stay right there. You got one more chance. Don't move. Oh, whoa. Work around. Cut off their retreat.
Take a while. Yep. Come on. Yep. Don't seem close. be done. Face. What? You think you're frightening or something? You're gonna get your skull cracked in talking like that?
Y'all right there, sir? Yes. Why? That's quite a sum. I hope you learned your lesson. Been some grip going around here, and I just thought, uh... Ah, you know what? Never mind. What can I do for you? Good morning. Bye. Morning to you. You sure brighten up the place? Thanks. You take care now, you. Yeah? See you soon. Hello again. Been a while since I've seen you, ain't it? Take a look. Hey, you might find a deal. Uh, show me what you got there. Aha! Say, you, you don't look so good, partner. You all right there? Well, I've been better, but that's how it goes. Well, I hope you improve soon. Got my full stock in there. All right then. Good business. Enjoy. Got what I need. Take care.
It's over now. Oh, God! No! No! Got some medicine. Better than nothing. Damn it, that won't help! Look at me! I'm bleeding out here. Can't. Can't. Stay. I can't. Hold. I get her. Need a hand there? Hey, careful how you go. Can't you see I'm tracking game here?
These droplets are fresh.
some land your way. Clear! I need to pass. Open very well with life, my friend. He won't send me the message. He won't. Yep. Yep. What's wrong? Hey, mister, have you seen my dog? I I've been looking everywhere for her. <laughs> She's been gone for hours. Can you help me find her, please? Sure, I'll keep an eye out. She's a foxhound. You know, white and brown. I if you find her, I live in a house on the edge of town. Thank you, mister. Hey there, kitty. Hey, cat. Thank <laughs> you. 
fine haul there. Hello, gentlemen. Hello there, sir. I got all I need, thank you. Hello, ma'am. Hello, ma'am. Hello. Mister. Hi. Looks you know like what? that's done, then. Forget about it. You need to find a new hobby, friend. Hey there, partner. Hey, partner. Hello, mister. Who's this, then? Decent town you got here. All right. Hello there. Howdy. Let's get you home. Oh, your buddy missed you, girl. Day to you all, fine people of Strawberry, by living in peace and harmony. Keep it moving. Come on. Listen, we keep your kind on a tight leash in this town. <laughs> so good to see you, girl. <laughs> oh. Thank you, thank you, mister. We ain't never spent a night apart. She's the closest thing to a family I got left. Glad I could help. You take care of her now. You keep an eye on her, kid. I will, mister. Mm. Thank you. That's a happy dog. That's right. You're a happy dog, ain't you? Uh, hey there, partner. Partner? Everything all right, sir? Nice around here. I'm kind of new to these parts. Hmm.
watch one of the deputies let a fella out of jail for a bottle of whiskey. It wasn't even the expensive stuff either. Ah, hello. I don't think I gave a receipt last time, did I? Let me do that right now. So, what are we looking at? This is a big one. Armored bank and coach heading into Strawberry. You'll probably need something to blow the doors. All right. Good seeing you, Hector.
See what's going on here. Okay, boy. Damn, if this ain't some gruesome shit. Yeah. Mister?
you, uh, you come down with something there, Park? Some bad flu going around. Nah, it's just a cough. Well, unfortunately, you ain't a horse, so I can't help you with that. But what can I help you with? Missing paperwork, okay? Welcome back, sir. So, buying or selling? Right, let's see. 
有人见到警长同佢嗰啲僆仔喺码头购票处附近饮酒啊。唉，点都好啦，你。I hope you make something pretty with that. Thanks for your help. Good morning. All made to measure. Hello, Miss. We are lucky for this lovely weather. Hello, sir. A lot of folk hunt, but not so many know their way around a needle and thread. I will have It's good business, I'm telling you. I've run this stall all the way from here to the border. The northern border, that is. And I've never been out of work. things I'd do if I had your youth. These days I'm fishing more and tracking less. My old man was right. Sneaks up on you. I don't sell to stores. You want my wares? Right here's the one place to find them. Every one of my garments is a little different, because every pelt is a little different. You'll find them nowhere else. <sighs> I'm still trying to keep my health up. A lot of folk hunt, but not so many know their way around a needle and thread. It's good business, I'm telling you. Well, then. <laughs> Sold. Young bucks have it easy down here in the south. 
I once tracked a bad-tempered moose four days across an ice sheet just to eat a square meal. Thanks, partner. All right, girl. Uh, buenos dias, señor. Fine morning to you. How's your name? Please. Something wrong or what? Hey, move it! Mr. Morgan! Hello, sister. Calderon. Brother Dorgans and I were talking about you just the other day and hoping we would see you again. How is Brother Dorkins? Oh, he's quite well. A little frustrated with the workings of our order. He keeps trying to be sent overseas, you know, do something with more challenge, maybe uh, be a missionary. He's a lovely man. Sure. And how are you? Uh, never better. Are you sure? Uh, I'm quite sure, sister. You know, a long time ago, I was like you. I very much doubt that. Oh, no, I did terrible things, awful things. And I could not stop doing terrible things because I did not believe that goodness existed. And then one day, I saw that love did exist. And ever since then, doing bad things became, well, not impossible, but pff, ridiculous. I guess I'm just hoping for a, a dignified exit. I shall pray for you. Oh, I'm not a religious man, sister. <laughs> I'm an outlaw. <laughs> oh, what fun. Religion is just a word. Hearts are rarely pure, but equally they are rarely impure either. Well, that's an interesting way of putting it. <laughs> to me, God is people and people are God, so we must all do what we can. These people are starving. Go find them some food. Don't worry so much about your heart. The actions will lead, and the heart follows. I'll still think of you in very nasty terms, as you wish. Every little helps! Sister, I think I've already got plenty of food on me. They could just eat mine. You are wonderful, Mr. Morgan. Now, that ain't true. Oh, I meant wonderful, but so very frightening. As you wish. Consider your good deed done for the day. I won't subject you to any more benevolence. Sister Ethel makes a fabulous stew. They will be so happy. Well, anyway, I must focus on the work at hand. Goodbye, then. I have already taken up far too much of your time. Hey, y'all. 
Good morning. Howdy there. Ladies. Good morning to you, mister. Well, hey. Hi there, mister. Hola. So sad. As you all know, a long you time coming. The state of Lemoyne has outgrown this man. Lies and perversions of the truth. But you, you have not gotten past your memory of it. Ha! This is a goddamn travesty. A federation built on lies. Lindsay Wolf. A senior member of now. the outlaw huh? gang they call the Lemoyne Raiders. Look here. Guilty Even got carpetbaggers taking Mom. bounty jobs. Arms dealing and Damn countless mongrel. atrocities against lawmen and state officials. I say to you today, we will not tolerate these intimidation tactics any longer. Come on. For laying waste to this good state and abusing the fine people in it, you will die. Hell, I'm weary of it. Pull it. Oh, oh, Lord. Now let this serve as a message to any well, of the ingrates that, that, that believe they know better than the United States. That got my heart. The morning will seek out gang activity and eliminate something. It. The Raiders are finished. I imagine that was a long time coming. Well, the Raiders are a goddamn menace, but there's much work to do yet. Howdy. These fellers, stuck in the past, all right. Yep, strange time. Morning to you. Good morning to you. Morning, mister. Good morning to you. Let's go, girl. Hi, Bill. Here's hoping for a better day. Mr. Trout. 
Hello. Ah, long dead. Another day. Hey, Reverend. Morning to you. Yeah, morning. How you doing, Jack? I'm scared, Uncle Arthur. All that shooting. Well, we're gonna move somewhere safe, okay? Morning. Good morning. I'm worried about you. Oh, not you two. Well, leave me alone, all of you. Okay, just checking. Okay. Things all right? Dread hey, Mary Beth. I understand. Morning. How are you doing? This place, it's horrible. Have you seen inside that cave? I know. It's only for now. Hang in there. Uh-huh. Yeah, Arthur. Some reunion, huh? Well, at least you're alive. So what now? We got a couple of days to work that out. Okay. Guess I'll leave you to it then. Okay. Miss Grimshaw? Well, hello, Arthur. Be about what? White two D four. You okay there? Working it all out. Once and for all, Arthur. Mm. What now? We're back, and I'm sitting here, and I am contemplating the great journey of the sun and considering a famous chess move. Those oily actors of a mediocre justice, the Pinkertons, and their benefactor, the depressing millionaire, Leviticus Cornwall, they want us, Arthur. They want us, and they are going to have us. Well, maybe they ain't the problem. Meaning? I don't know. It's just... <laughs> I can't help but feel we would have been better running off someplace else. Oh, but the, the game ain't over, Arthur. I mean, I ain't, I ain't played my my final move, but... I guess I'm more interested in saving lives than winning at chess. And maybe life ain't such a thing to cling on to so tightly. No doubt. What about the women? You sound like Hosea. I miss... 
Um, I asked you a question. What do you think? We can't stay here. That much is obvious. Where are we gonna run to? I mean, they chased us from the west. They chased us over the mountains. They ran us into the sea. All right, sir. Do you have my bag? Always, Dutch. But there's more than your bag to worry about. We need more money. We've been on the run for months now, and I've seen you killing folk in cold blood like you always told me not to. And I'm sorry, but I can't help but think that if we just... There is country in Roanoke Ridge past Butcher Creek. I believe we could hold. Okay. You and Charles, you could take folks up that way. Micah and I need to do some reconnaissance. I ain't got a final plan yet. Arthur, I ain't got it. I just need time. I need time and no traitors. Charles. Be right with me. Always. Where are we headed? Up past Butcher Creek. It's Murphy Brew Country. That's why I'm asking you to ride with me. I understand. What are we doing there? We're looking for a place to hold up. Even the law won't follow us up there too willingly. Yeah. I did some scouting up there while you boys were away. And? Mm. You'll see. I know the way. Follow me. We need to get this done fast. The Pinkertons will have reinforced in another day or two. Yeah, the sooner we get out of here, the better. Ha! It's quite a ride up there. I saw some canoes near the bridge up river, which would take us right up to Butcher Creek. Might be quicker. What do you think? Yeah, a boat's probably a good idea. Okay, good. It's good to see you again, Charles. You too. Thanks for what you did in San Denis. Real brave drawing them off us like that. I was worried you and Abigail had both got yourselves killed. I found a spot to lie low for a while, then managed to get a ride with a wagon of workers heading out to the fields. Abigail said she somehow managed to slip away when they grabbed Hosea. You did good getting the others out of there, keeping everyone together. Everybody was pretty shaken up when I got back to Shady Bell. Uh, it was a tough few days. I couldn't have done it without Sadie. So how did you find that spot back there? I assume the skulls on sticks weren't an addition to yours. <laughs> Old Strauss knew about it. The locals are terrified of the place, so we figured that might buy us some time. And it did. Until one of you brought the law with you. Where did you end up again? Cuba? Oh, uh, not exactly. An island off of there, called Guarma. Landed ourselves in a heap of trouble. Really? A tropical island? Isn't that just what Dutch wanted? Uh, I guess it didn't exactly live up to his ideals. Anyway, I ain't always sure our Dutch knows what he wants anymore. Perhaps not, but he's always managed to figure things out in the past. I know. Hey, you're right. So I'm just... It's been... Uh... Guess I just miss Hosea and his uh, wisdom, you know? Of course. There's the bridge. There should be some canoes down to the right here. Well, 
I see one anyway. And that'll do. Come on. Okay, Butcher Creek is a few miles upriver. So I spent some time up this way while you were gone. I ran into rains fall and eagle flies. The Indians? And I've been trying to help out a bit where I can at the reservation. Things are bad there. That's not a surprise. They seem to be in a lot of trouble and heading into more. Some men there spoke a lot about the Murphy gang that hides out in these caves. And we're gonna need to be careful. They're animals. Everyone is terrified of them. Great! Dutch didn't mention this. Well, hiding up here, it's not a crazy idea. This is a spot nobody comes near, even the law. But just be ready. It won't be pretty. So be it. Your creek up ahead. Who are they? The locals. Well, they don't look too friendly. Wait until you meet the Murphys. All right, let's walk it from here. Good evening. You know how we get to the caves at Beaver Hollow? You'll get away if you know what's good for you. Come on, they're not gonna help us. I'm pretty sure it's to the north, up the road here. Murphy Hills, stranger. Might watch where you wander. It's a bit of a walk. You could grab those horses if you want. You probably won't miss them if we get them back by morning. See why folks don't want to come around here. They ain't exactly a welcoming place. Lots of stories of people going missing around these parts. 
Just recently, a stagecoach from Annisburg disappeared without a trace coming through here. Guess that's good for us. Assuming these inbred bastards are willing to part with their home, which I'm sure they won't be too pleased about. No, but I believe they hide out all over Roanoke Ridge. These caves are just one of their spots, which is why we should keep it down. They might have lookouts around. Okay. You see that up ahead? Slow down, keep it quiet. It could be some of them. I say we dismount here and follow them on foot. See where they're going. Follow me, stay quiet. Let's get closer to him. Come on, up this way. Definitely Murphy's. I say we deal with them from here. You take one, I'll take the other. Good job. Uh, we must be close now. Let's stop and have a look from the top of this hill there. Come on. Stagecoach went missing. Jesus. They must be in the cave. All right. Let's get on with this. Okay. What you think? I'm gonna head into the cave or flush them out with dynamite. Let's surprise them in there. Okay. Let's get a little closer. Ready? Let's get this over with.
Get that poor girl out of the cage. <laughs> Please don't kill me. It's okay, miss. <laughs> Stay away from me. We ain't gonna hurt you. Don't touch me. <laughs> Just calm down. From Antisburg. What do we do with her? We take her there and we'll go get the others. Sure. Miss, you okay to ride on my horse a little? I'll keep you safe. Antisburg, right? Yes. Hey. Um, it's okay, miss. The others, they... They killed them. You're safe now. Just... Try to breathe. They're animals. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's all right, miss. Why would they... Some folks is just evil. Ain't no point trying to explain it. I haven't slept in days. <laughs> I know. What's your name, miss? It's okay. Meredith. You're gonna be home soon, Meredith. And this will all be over. Thank you. Where in Annisburg? One of the mining cottages. Um, <laughs> if you get me to the main street, I can show you from there. Okay. Just try to relax now. from there. Saw some pretty bad things, I'm afraid, man. Murphy Brew got. Oh my God! How did you manage well, to? I just ran into them and found her. Oh, thank you. Here, let me give you this. 
Oh, that, that's okay, ma'am. You just keep her warm and keep her safe. This is death? Oh, no. You leave me alone. You just leave me alone. Thanks, buddy. How you get on? Okay. Found a girl. I took her home. Oh. You and Micah find anything? Maybe. I think maybe. I found our old friend, Mr. Cornwall. You did? Yeah. He's buying a stake in the mine in Annisburg. Relentlessly ambitious fella, isn't he? Micah and I'll sniff about, see if he knows we're here, and exactly what his plans are. So, George, did you miss me? I found her... Drunk as Saint Denis. You're back. How jolly, Miss it's O'Shea. It's funny, you stuck of shit. Back Who and you? drunk. The master, the Lord Molly. God, almighty. Calm down. I won't be ignored. George Vanderlyn, I am in him. I ain't her. I ain't his stooges. Calm yourself. You don't owe me nothing. Miss. I don't owe you nothing. Nothing. Okay. I'll spit in your eye. I did. I told them. I'm sorry? You know, I told him, I tell him again. Now I've got God's ear. You told who what? Mr. Milton and Mr. Ross about the bank robbery. And I wanted them to kill you. You did what? I loved you, you goddamn bastard. Go on, She's shoot crazy. me. She ain't worth it. You told on <laughs> oh, me. You're you not betrayed so now, me. What? You calm down. Arthur? <laughs> She's a fool. Get her out of here. You know the rules. You're not so big now. Hurry, Your Majesty. You... Train her. She knew the rules, Arthur. What the hell is wrong with you? Mr. Pearson, Mr. Williamson, get this body out of here and get it burnt. Okay. Now get back to work, all of you. Quit your lollygagging. Right. Get back to work. Yeah. Miss Crenshaw, a nasty woman. You think I wanted to shoot her? You seem to like it. I saw that beady look in your eye. You're drunk again. And you're a fucking murderer. She broke the rules. She did no such thing. She was in love. You sour-faced old crow. Goddamn you. Murderer. 